To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is nobler to pollinate the fields of tulip beds and rocking waves of zephyr, or billow out a swarm of brethren against a huge oppressor, sting perchance to die, to buzz no more, and by to sting to say we end the thorax ache and thousand natural shocks in every waking minute the wings are subject to. Ay, there's the point. Slight prick managed to snag a foreign abscess, cling and pull it out, bare bodkin made clean of its natural tether, to act and then to let this unsheathed barb, from root of abdomen untimely ripped, compel our motion to our stingless death. Their pity, oh, and death, where is thy sting? To move our fuzzy flesh from honeycomb, to laugh as we bumble from flower petal to petal, gathering our stock and stuff when with so little force we can be crushed. That then, the work, the toil, the death, so sweet the honey we protect, we sacrifice our final bond to this our mortal core, propel ourselves as bullets done from slings, the missiles fired off haphazardly, to strike by fear, chance, or misapprehension, transform our flesh from bumbling about with blunt distraction to pointed decision. What gives us pause, our thoughts and ponderings go missing, and we drop arms with tails to pierce the source of misery. Tis a point undone perhaps too thoughtlessly. Tis done with less a sting than were a prick, and ne'er was done again as to be. But when the bug has caught its mark, then it will no more be.